Welcome to Apple Pay Workshop. It's Tianjie here. Today I want to do some travel notebook, but uh, I want to this video. I want to show you guys uh, one way the I I draw it using this way. And because a lot of friends ask me about uh, how to draw how to painting, uh, um, because they are they say have the other way or have different way because they are using the tra traditional way to train their their self and. Uh, they feel very frustrated and they feel uh, why the, the drawing is very difficult and uh, today I want to share to you guys one of my ways I call it uh, nice square nice square drawing <laughs> using a nice square to draw your stuff and uh, to draw a photo and I feel this way is uh, very good for the uh, if you are the na uh, you are na na it's not called you're not good on a drawing is uh, you didn't train yourself for a long time maybe you are a totally new guy for a drawing and all you just uh, love the art and you want to try but you feel very frustrated on the start and that's the uh, one way I was going to share to you and will make you more comfortable on art maybe in the future you are going to uh, fall in love in, for art uh, will get it more interesting okay let's go Hi guys, uh, today I want to show you guys uh, how to do uh, uh, my nice square drawing, okay? And uh, the first thing is you have a few things you got to have, your your ruler, and I prefer if you can buy this kind of ruler, I feel this is very useful, so I hope you guys, everyone can have one. And uh, you need your pencil, and your your pen, or your fountain pen, and eraser. And uh, let, let's, I, I will say that that's all I need for a drawing. And okay, first uh, I, I show you guys why it's called nice square drawing. First, uh, you guys you can put, put the one, uh, one picture or one photo you want to paint or draw. Uh, you can be an animal or uh, anything. But I feel for a start you want to learn this uh, nice square drawing. I prefer you guys going to find a like a one animal or a one, uh, the, I feel the one animal, one animal or the one like a car or something is one item will be perfect for a uh, when you just start want to training your art because you are the totally new guy so you better don't want to draw too many things in one time because they will make you frustrated you will feel is tired and you are going to quit the art so. That's the nice square way I want to show you guys. First, for example, sometimes uh, we want to paint like uh, this bird, this owl. Uh, you put out a photo and uh, you want to paint it, you just already start to get frustrated because oh, it's so many things I need to paint, so many things I want, need to draw. It's too tired, it's too many. These things, uh, small detail, and you are going to quit, you are going to stop. But uh, today I want to tell you guys uh, what, what it's called nice square drawing. You like uh, this out? Uh, now I already using the, my ruler. My ruler to draw this nice square. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. And, uh, and uh, it's nice square here. So this time when we draw it, we don't think that is one big painting we don't think this way because if you think okay i need to paint all of that and you you are a totally new guy you are going to feel oh that's too much for me i cannot handle that that's too much for me okay so the one the way i want to teach you guys is uh, every time we paint when you draw a nice square every time you paint you're going to think about only one square okay only one only this one so if we're going to think this way see now i only want to paint this square things become much easier all i need to paint is only there right and also the eye and some fair make some mark right the things become much easier Okay, when you finish this square, okay, now I jump in, go to another square, okay? Right? Everything become very easy and simple. 
Okay, now I we're going to take my trail notebook and show you guys how is this things work. First, you're going to use your printer, or you can you know you go uh, your magazine. You want to paint something and uh, have a in magazine have beautiful photo, or you, on your newspaper or have a beautiful photo. You want to paint it, you just take it and draw big nice uh, nice square. For example. This each square I have right now is uh, uh, 40 nn. Okay, each one is 40 nn. 40 nn. Okay, so it's uh, everyone is the same. So now I have uh, uh, 40 nn. Each one is like that, and I draw a nice square. Now I want to paint it at my travel notebook. But you guys can see my travel notebook is smaller than the, the, the stuff I painted. So, if they are using the 40 nn, oh sorry, sorry, it's not 40 nn, it's the, uh, there is the 60. 60, okay? I'm sorry, it's the 60. Uh, yeah, it's 60, okay? It's 60 nn. And at my notebook, I want to uh, know the uh, first. I I want to know how how big is my insert. Okay, my insert is close to seven seventeen cm. So all I can, if I want to do this, this is all the the will be the total will be hundred eighty nm. So it's uh, bigger than my paper. So I need to think, okay, so what, what's the size on the pen? So I just design my square, each one will be this one. Each one will be 40 and then, okay? Each one is 40. 40. 40 and then, okay? So I get a same square as uh, this one. Okay, this is this one is uh, 60 nn, but I want to paint in a smaller place. Each one is uh, become a 40 nn. And uh, another thing is uh, using your to draw this uh, nice square, uh, like uh, using fountain pen and draw on the this uh, the things you print now. Yeah, that's cool. Uh, when you draw on the paper, I prefer you guys don't using the the pencil to to do. Uh, don't use this kind of pencil to draw your line because the pencil, the, the up layer is uh, too big and so sometimes it will be bigger or smaller. So you better use in this kind. Uh, it's uh, very small and you can draw a lot of detail and uh, be, become curved. Uh, I want 40 nm here, I want 40 nm here, they will be sure it's 40 nm, okay? So, I got a square just like here, okay? Now, we're going to do the things we call a nice square painting. Okay, now we want to draw the uh, square one. Draw a square one. <coughs> the things we want to need to paint is this one. And I see, okay, there, have uh, this uh, house head and have eye. And okay, so when you paint it, just like that, okay, it's here, from there. Uh, layer go layer, so it's uh, a little, um, you can't become three. One, two, three, and three, this nice stuff on there. One, two, three, okay. One, two, three, and stuff on there. Go to up there. So, that's our square one for the house head, this side. And the eye is almost there, go there, half, half, right? And they have the their face there, have some some their the color here. And uh, see the head here. They have like things like that. So I need to uh, draw something like that. Okay. And there is the fade. Okay. Now. <coughs> I want to go to the second one. This one. This uh, second one, want to paint here. 
So I need to paint easily. Right? Only this. Okay. I just uh, show you guys how 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 going to painting. What's the the points on this one? Okay. Now I want to draw the second square. Okay. It's from there. Go there. I tell you guys one more time. Now you using a nice square way to painting or drawing. Just focus it when every square. Okay. Just focus on every square. Don't look other side. Just one square. Okay. Focus on this one only. Okay. From there. And uh, there is from there start. Go to this way. Okay. And this one. Go down like that. And uh, look at that. Here is, uh, is the head's the center. There. Okay. So the uh, the mouse here and okay the eye another half eye okay from there eye of course the nice square way is for the if you are the new guy on the art or you didn't train yourself a lot. And I feel that's a very good way for a new guy because you don't feel frustrated. Only one time draw one square. I feel that that's very good for uh, you, you just want to start to try in the art. Okay. Okay. Now you got a second square. Okay. And now, of course, the nice square way if you are a professional, you no need to use in this way. But I sometimes I still using a nice square to draw something because if I want to draw a human face, I want it just like the uh, what it look like. So I will use a nice square way to help me to doing the drawing become the uh, more like the uh, this this human uh, this, this this guy's face. Okay, so this one very simple. Now we don't look. <coughs> We don't look at the tree all these things, so we just want to change this, painting this out. So this one, only there. Okay, square three, only there. See, it's much easier, right? Okay, go down. Okay, now we go to the, uh, we go to a square four. It's the same, only look at this square, okay? Here. Yeah. The things we need to paint is only there, okay? So, then there down, and from there go there, okay? Okay, now we go to the uh, square number five, okay? Square number five. You will see a lot of fear, but don't don't worry about it. Just uh, paint uh, something like that, that. That's enough for the painting. Just you if you go to a, using a square way to make it yourself. Don't get frustrated. You need to one time paint this big one. You'll be the uh, paint uh, just like that and uh, little frustrated. Okay, from there, go there, and uh, there is uh, from there, go there. Okay, and there have the the, the feather from there go there, and there have one thing uh, from there go there, right? Okay. So, uh, this one you you can draw. And I would say it's a more rough way. It's a no need to draw just like a photo, but uh, just draw almost like a day is enough, okay? Okay, now we go to the square six. The things we need to draw is there, there, and there, okay? 
So very simple. Okay. Down. Okay. Now we go to the square seven. Square seven is zero because I I say I don't want to draw any tree right now. So square seven is zero. So we don't need to draw anything. That's cool. And uh, ah, there I uh, I forgot to draw something on the square five. The fader is here. There is a red feather. Okay, now we go to the square A because this all must have the sun place to stand there. So this tree we must draw. So okay, is on there. This one I must draw. Okay, that's square A. From there, go there. Okay. Okay, that's square eight. Now we go to a square nine. Yeah, look at that. We almost finished this painting. Square nine, we need to paint this only. Draw this. Okay. So, is from there. Go there. That's the end. So start we need to from there and go there. There one. Okay, go down two. Okay. Look at that. We only finish one joint. And uh, look at that, how easy is that? You will feel, oh, that's too much for me, that I was going to feel so fast to that. But now we're using a nice square way. Every time, just draw one square. Every time, draw one square. Every time, draw one square. Every time, draw one square. You see? Be easy. You got out. And uh, uh, I was going to, because I don't want the video too long. Next time I will show you how to use in a fountain pen to paint this. Okay? Now we just uh, leave these things like that and uh, let me uh, talk to you guys next time. Okay? See you guys next time. Bye!